It's here at Makerspace, a workshop in Bayview, where these men are using their expertise to help strangers more than 5,000 miles away. We're going to have to drill this half of this out deeper. Dr. Stephen Burkholz now spends his retired days with Glenn Livermore performing surgery. <laughs> aluminum, creating tools used in surgery. So why is this something you wanted to do? I guess I'm an orthopedist with a machining problem. <laughs> I don't know. I love it. The longtime orthopedist is part of the Isaiah Mission Foundation, a small organization that started five years ago creating medical supplies. Okay, now, now you have a drill for surgery, okay, and it costs Instead of costing $5,000, it costs $50. For hospitals in Africa. But recently, Dr. Burkholz changed gears. So this rolls like this, it slides. Creating an external bone stabilizer for orthopedists in Ukraine. Which kind of bypasses the fracture, but stabilizes it. Now you can transport the patient without much pain, without worry about more tissue, soft tissue damage. With Eastern European hospitals in need of thousands of these devices, Dr. Burkholz created the design and Livermore. So kind of what's your role in all of this? Um, chief gopher. Um, he wants something made, I'll make it. The two using what they know to help those facing such an unknown. So I can see those surgeons right now just pulling their hair out, saying, yep, I'll try and take care of you, but not having the wherewithal, so that's what I'm trying to do. In Milwaukee, Hina Hilliard, WISN 12 News. And the organization does all of this free of charge. Dr. Bergholz wants to connect with a Polish manufacturer to quickly get the device into hospitals there.